Is wildlife a favorite topic of yours? Just curious. Well, let's begin. The Nilgai is the largest Asian antelope and is ubiquitous across the northern Indian subcontinent. It is the sole member of the genus Bozalaphus and was described by Peter Simon Pallas in 1766. A sturdy thin-legged antelope, the Nilgai is characterized by a sloping back, a deep neck with a white patch on the throat, a short crest of hair along the neck terminating in a tuft, and white facial spots. A column of pendant coarse hair hangs from the dewlap ridge below the white patch. Sexual dimorphism is prominent while females and juveniles are orange to tawny, adult males have a bluish-gray coat. Only males possess horns. The Nilgai is diurnal. The animals band together in three distinct kinds of groups, one or two females with young calves, three to six adult and yearling females with calves, and all male groups with two to eighteen members. Typically tame, the Nilgai may appear timid and cautious if harassed or alarmed, it flees, galloping away from the source of danger. Herbivores, Nilgai prefer grasses and herbs, though they commonly eat woody plants in the dry tropical forests of India. Females become sexually mature by two years, while males do not become sexually active until four or five years old. The time of the year when mating takes place varies geographically, but a peak breeding season lasting three to four months can be observed at most places. Gestation lasts eight to nine months, following which a single calf is born. As typical of several bovid species, Nilgai calves stay hidden for the first few weeks of their lives. The lifespan of the Nilgai is around 10 years. The Nilgai prefers areas with short bushes and scattered trees in scrub forests and grassy plains. It is common in agricultural land but rarely in dense forest. Major populations occur in the Indian and Nepal Terai. It was thought to be extinct in Bangladesh. The Nilgai was introduced to Texas in the 1920s to 1930s. As of 2008, the feral population in Texas is nearly 37,000. The Nilgai is categorized as least concern on the IUCN Red List. The Nilgai has been associated with Indian culture since the Vedic period. They were hunted in the Mughal era and are depicted in numerous miniatures. Nilgai have been considered a pest in several North Indian states as they ravage crop fields and cause considerable damage. In Bihar, authorities have classified the Nilgai as vermin. Herbivores, the Nilgai prefer grasses and herbs, woody plants are commonly eaten in the dry tropical forests of India. Studies suggest they may be browsers or mixed feeders in India, whereas they are primarily grazers in Texas. The Nilgai can tolerate interference by livestock and degradation of vegetation in its habitat better than deer, possibly because they can reach high branches and do not depend on surface vegetation. Observations of females in southern Texas revealed that ovaries are developed by two years of age and the first birth takes place typically a year later, though in a few cases females as young as one and a half years may mate successfully. I am glad that you could spend some time for these wonderful animals. Take care, God bless.